Today on All Back Cards, we're doing a speed break of a box of 2011 Topps Pro Debut Baseball. This hobby box has 24 eight card packs and each box contains two autographs and two relic cards. The base set comes paralleled in blue to 309, gold to 50, and there are one ones in red and printing plates. Inserts include all-stars in single A, double A, and triple A, minor league materials in regular and jumble patch, solo signatures, side-by-side -side autographs, debut cut autographs, and the one that everyone will be chasing, this one-of-one -one Bryce Harper cut autograph. Now let's get to the break. Okay, here's our speed break of Pro Debut. For those of you unfamiliar, you're going to see every card that we pulled from this box in a fraction of the time that it took to open it. If there's any card that you want to take a look at more closely, simply pause the video, like on this relic card of D. Gordon. Uh, and when you're done looking at it, um, restart the video, you'll get to see everything. There's a Brandon Belt memorabilia, so we knocked out two hits in the first three packs very early on. So you have your uh, cards that uh, the minor league teams issue themselves, but this is the only official release for minor league baseball um, that's exclusive. And Topps has it. Um, they've scheduled another one, Topps Heritage Minor League Baseball, which should be interesting since we uh, really enjoyed the release of Heritage this year for a regular baseball. This includes all the uh, minor league teams, but obviously not every single player. Topps has made their selection for the checklist. Uh, a lot of movement. So there are some players that you'll see here on certain teams that have already either moved up or down. But this is a good representation of um, the best that's out there in the minor leagues right now. And uh, a lot of them, as you'll see from the uh, insignia on the upper right-hand corner, there's our, one of our hits, um, Jesse Biddle autograph. Uh, you'll see on the upper right-hand corner um, a foil marker and this mean, that means that this is their pro debut and this is their first card. Another one of our hits, David Bromberg Auto. And right behind it is a third auto, cut auto, for uh, Aaron Hicks, debut cut. And there was Mike Trout. So you gotta love it when you get a bonus hit in any of these boxes. Um, like I said, we were promised uh, two autographs and two relics and walked away with a third autograph. But of course, this is the year of Bryce and the big chase is for the Bryce Harper cut auto. And um, so far, at least at the time of the releasing of this video, um, we have not seen anybody that has pulled the one of one cut auto which involves um, a ball that was signed by Bryce Harper that was then uh, made into a card. So all in all, a uh, really nice set for minor league collectors, great for prospecting, great for going down to the ballparks and getting some autographs. And with this pack, that should do it for this box. And here are the top 10 hits of the box. At number 10, the Zach Britton Double A All Stars. At number 9, the Blue Caleb Coward. At number 8, the Blue J.R. Murphy. At number 7, the Blue Hack Julie. At number 6, the Gold Kenneth Allison. At number 5, the David Bromberg Auto. At number 4, the D. Gordon Materials Card. At number 3, the Brandon Belt Materials Card. At number two, the Jesse Biddle autograph number to 199. And at number one, the Aaron Hicks debut cut auto number to 95. And that will do it for this speed break. Thanks for watching. Make sure you check out our blog and our Facebook page. Follow us on Twitter and subscribe to our YouTube channel.